Hey, what is going on, all the YouTubers? This is Code Agent Ten, and today I'm bringing you my first ever episode of Coding with Code. And today I'm going to show you how to create the matrix effect, um, well, using Notepad. So first thing you want to do is you're going to want to get your Notepad ready here. Uh, just double click it, open it up, uh, just get this on full screen. Uh, what you're going to want to do is you just want to type in the in the coding, but I'm not going to waste your time typing it all in. I'm just going to copy and paste. Uh, all of this will be in the description below, so you can just copy and paste. Uh, in order to save it, what you're going to want to do is you want to go into File. Uh, you're going to want to save it as. Uh, select a file that you want to put it in. I'm just going to stick it on my desktop because I really can't bother to put it in the file. Uh, let's change the file name. So let's put it as uh, hi dot dat. You have to save it into a back file. So what you want to do there is you just want to put your file name here, and then you have to put in dot bat bat. And the next thing you're going to want to do is you want to put it onto all files. This has to be on all files, otherwise it will not work. Uh, then you just want to save it. Let's just shrink that, bring this over here, uh, open that up, and there we go, you have the matrix effect. Now, this originally, if you haven't already changed the properties of the programming itself, um, it will turn out as white, but I've already changed the properties of all of this, so it's going to come, so it's, it's green, and the screen is bigger. But yeah, you, you can change all of this in the properties, but I'm not going to show you how to do that. So yeah, if you found this commentary helpful, then you know, please leave a like down below and hit that subscribe button as it's free, so you might as well. <laughs> I will be making more little commentaries like this in the future. Uh, if you have any questions in particular, if you're having any problems, please leave a comment down below and I will do my best to help you. So, yeah. Thanks a lot, and uh, see you later, YouTubers.